A warning tonight from lifeguards. Reports of flash rip currents in the Gulf. They're seeing a lot more this summer than usual. And those flash currents can hit even when green flags are flying. News 5's Cody Long is live tonight at Pensacola Beach to tell us how dangerous these currents can be. Cody? Yeah, Peter, it's often called a flash rip, and it can just pop up out of nowhere, even on a smooth, calm day like today. And it actually sent a woman to the hospital here yesterday afternoon. And lifeguards want swimmers to know about the rip current risk. This year, for whatever reason, we have had a lot more flash rip currents than we normally have, and those are a lot more difficult to predict. They, they, they show up unexpectedly. Pensacola Beach Water Safety Captain Jake Wilson says lifeguards have been busy. Even when there are green and yellow flags, there can be deadly flash rip currents. These are rip current channels that are not uh, carved into the underwater seabed. Um, these just flash randomly at different times when big sets of waves come in. A man and woman were caught in one Tuesday afternoon when yellow flags were flying. Maintain a respect for the Gulf because it is, it is powerful. Wilson says to swim near lifeguard stands. If you do get caught in a rip current, relax. Don't panic. Let it take you out and then wave for help or swim back to shore. Memorial Day weekend alone, lifeguards here rescued more than 70 people in the Gulf. He says the extreme heat is also causing a lot of problems this summer. Uh, make sure you stay in the shade, stay cool, stay hydrated, um, wear sunscreen. Too much exposure out here in these temperatures and humidity levels can cause some severe heat problems. And we have seen several drownings in Destin and along the Alabama beaches, but so far this year, here at Pensacola Beach, they have had no drownings, and they hope to keep it that way. Reporting live from Pensacola Beach, I'm Cody Long, WKRG News 5.